and it's just a, a solemn, amazing moment for all of us. And there's another amazing drum shot. Lauren, you explained this a little bit earlier about and that small failures in the system would not lead to a mission failure. Falcon 9 was already able to hand it, handle it. NASA astronauts Bob Behnken and Doug Hurley, Doug on the left, Bob on the right, waving to the crowd there to cheer them on. Seconds into flight, stage one propulsion is nominal. T plus 30 seconds into this historic mission. Flying crew on board Dragon and Falcon 9, and look at them go. Falcon power telemetry nominal. M1D throttle down. We're throttling down to get ready for the period of maximum dynamic pressure. We're in the throttle bucket. Reports say all systems are go. Vehicle is supersonic. We've exceeded Mach 1 on the Falcon 9. M1D throttle up. We're throttling Max back up to full power as we're One through Bravo. Max Q. Copy. One Bravo. We heard that one Bravo call out. That's just the second abort zone that they're in. They'll continue to be on this until the first stage has done its job and they switch over to the second. At this point, 
Bob and Doug pulling about 2.3 Gs, 2.3 times the Earth's gravity, already moving at over 1,500 miles per hour. We've heard the call out for MVAC engine chill. That's getting the MVAC engine ready to light. That'll come at about 2.44 into flight. Right now, everything continuing to look good. Next major event coming up is going to be the triple. We'll have main engine cutoff of the nine first stage engines, stage separation, and then ignition of the second stage engine to continue to carry astronauts into orbit. Coming up in about 20 seconds. M M1D throttle down. We heard we're throttling down the Merlin engines on the first stage. And we have Miko. Miko. Two Alpha. Falcon stage separation confirmed. Copy two Alpha. And back ignition. All right, we have stage separation confirmed. The first stage beginning its flight back. The second stage being powered by that single Merlin 1D vacuum engine has ignited and is now carrying loss. Bob and Doug into orbit. Just about 10 seconds away from that first stage, starting that entry burn on your right screen, we should be able to see that view live. Stage one entry burn startup. And there is that entry burn that beginning. Burn. This burn lasts about 36 seconds long. Stage two FTS is saved. Well, that entry burn continues. We're just about a minute away from SECO. We'll have a number of events all happen in rapid succession. It'll Talking be the shutdown. second engine cutoff. Stage one we'll be looking for down. that uh, stage one landing burn shortly after. Yeah, actually, just within a few seconds of each other. It's such a cool view on your left screen, seeing Bob and Doug on Dragon. Right now, you can see the displays that they are seeing right now themselves. Terminal guidance. And back throttle step. We are coming up 25 seconds or so away from SECO, or second engine cutoff. This is also the point where Bob and Doug are experiencing second engine cutoff. Now we are waiting for our first stage to make its way to our drone ship. Of course, I still love Dragon, you. Dragon, SpaceX, nominal orbital insertion. It is confirmation is nominal Dragon orbital captain, insertion. Nominal stage orbital one, insertion. Deploy. And what you're seeing on your screen is a live view of our drone ship where our first stage will be coming down. Looks like we lost that live view, but we'll wait for confirmation of that landing shortly here. Falcon 9 first stage is successfully landed. And there you can see on your screen, Falcon 9 has landed. This is the first Falcon 9 to carry okay, humans to in. orbit, so very exciting for us. And as you can see on your right screen, Bob and Doug are still making their way to their targeted orbit. Everyone <laughs> need a recovery one. So exciting today. Waiting for confirmation now of that. Dragon setup. separation confirmed. Dragon separation <laughs> confirmed. <laughs> there is a great view right in front of you Compound of dragons December. separating. Separation confirmed. And there's that call out. Dragon is now officially making its way to the International Space Station today. <laughs> Dragon SpaceX with that separation call. Uh, we have a few words for you from our Falcon 19. Standing by. Dragon, Chief Engineer on Dragon to Ground. Bob Doug, on behalf of the entire launch team, thanks for flying with Falcon 9 today. We hope you enjoyed the ride and wish you a great mission. Thanks, Bala. Congratulations to you and the F9 team for the first uh, human 
ride for Falcon 9, and it was incredible. Uh, appreciate all the hard work, and uh, thanks for the great uh, ride to space. Copy all. Oh, and like to be proud of you guys and the rest of the team. Uh, thank you so much for what you've uh, done for us today, putting America back into low Earth orbit from the Florida coast. Copy all. Good luck. Godspeed. We should get to that hold point in just about four minutes, moving at our current pace. I think you can see uh, a meatball and American flag on that uh, on the spacecraft. So we're closing in at less than a tenth of a meter per second at this point. You can see the, the surface section Draco is just doing all these very small, minor attitude corrections. Really, the, the autonomous docking system at work, making sure that the, the uh, vestibule and the soft capture system is lined up with IDA2, it's the international docking adapter. Again, we're racing that sunset. This dragon continues to close, four meters to go. Those shadows of the of the space station on the vehicle. Yeah, you can actually see the uh, centerline camera pretty clearly there, um, sort of with the contrast of the, the sun right now. Three meters to go. Two meters. We are inside the hands-off point, the chop, the crew hands-off point. One meter to go. Soft capture complete. Dragon in Soft capture confirmed. Stand by for retraction and docking. So once soft capture is complete, and uh, I believe we'll get that call from from our core here, Anna, then uh, we'll get we'll get confirmation of hard capture, and uh, the crew, of course, aboard have have this information on their displays, so they'll also see indication of hard capture complete. We have Bob Bankin from SpaceX Demo 2 mission entering the International Space Station. Followed by Doug Hurley. And Station Houston, we see you, and it, it's a... The trampoline is working. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's an inside joke. I know what you're in, Inside about. joke, yeah. <laughs>